greetings, stranger. Have you found Killian? I came across Killian in a cave near the woodcutter's camp. He'd taken refuge there from the wolves, which he held for demons. Wolves? Demons? Is he okay? Don't worry, they were just wolves. They're dead now, anyway. And your nephew should have arrived at the castle by now. Oh, thank you, stranger. Thank you. My sister Semele's already started to worry about him. Here, take this. It isn't much, but it'll serve you well. Greetings! Look here, a new face. Who are you? Baldrin. I used to work in the woodcutter's camp once, but that's all history now. Damned war. What's going on here? We're taking the wounded to the castle and burying the fallen. Well, the ones we managed to find. But you were on the battlefield, weren't you? Only on the extreme edge. Even there, the ground is burnt down. What about the rest of the battlefield? I don't know. A landslide blocked the pass. Buried half of the army. Gilthor wanted to clear the debris, but this big, creepy head... What about the head? Some enormous, hideous stone face. Nasty as a dog's ass. I swear it was watching me all the time. And something behind it scraped, clattered, and... Made noise, but nobody answered our calls. I thought the battle took place up north. There too. We we're on the way back, and uh, and the Rangers Guild lent us some provisions. What's with the Rangers? Dead or fled. The Grand Master Craglin must be loitering somewhere. He ducked out from the battle. Cowardly swine. Tell me something about this region. Quite far in the northeast from here is a battlefield. The castle is located in the south, and my old camp lies quite close. North from here. Goblins living in the caves have been giving us quite some trouble lately. Beyond the castle in the south live the orcs. They used to be harmless, but they've gone haywire now. The orcs went haywire? Earlier, they wouldn't hurt a fly. Yet they launched an attack on the castle recently. What's going on with the goblins? The beasts used to be merely impudent. However, they've become literally dangerous since the war started. Those in the south steal everything that isn't pinned down. While the ones in the north eat everything they can get their hands on. Even humans.
Craglin. He's alive. Really? Where is he? He's been looking for the survivors on the battlefield. Finally, some good news. Thanks. Gate. No way, stranger. Nobody enters without the Castellan's permission. I spoke with Gilthor. I was to bring Doran back from the battlefield. And so I have. He's on his way now. Oh, yes. The Castellan mentioned this. Forgive my being rude. Ever since Lord Gowan was imprisoned, we've been very careful here. What did you say? Lord Gowan is in prison? The Lord of the Castle. Haven't you heard? Orcs kidnapped him. How did that happen? You should talk to Wellguard, the blacksmith. He can tell you the whole story. Open the gate, then. Of course. Get inside. Look at that. Please don't forget about the healing. The wounded here can't wait much longer. Got some nuts for you. Here, take them. Oh, thank you so much. Now we can prepare more healing salves. Wonderful. Sure thing. Can you use this recipe? I found it in the castle. What are you doing here? I travel between Tushu and Sua, but the orcs tried to attack me and I was forced to run back to the castle. Now I'm waiting for someone to teach them a lesson. The orcs are agitated. I've known them for years, and they've always been friendly. They buy mead from me from time to time. A couple of months ago, however, they started becoming more aggressive. The assault a few days ago was a sad escalation. Tell me about the assault. I was on the road to Tushu with my cart when they charged from the forest. Four or five orcs holding a club in one hand and a bottle of booze in the other. They were swaying and tripping over their legs and bawling attack. Then I noticed another group down the road before me. I turned my cart and returned to the castle. One drunken orc is ridiculous, but a bunch of them are dangerous. What are you going to do now? I'll do my best to help people here. Once the region is safe again, I'll return to my business. Have you seen Gilthor? The Castellan is in the Citadel, upstairs by the fireplace. 
I'd like to look at your goods. The archives should be in here. Archives? You mean the basement, perhaps? The one with loads of books? One may enter with the Baron's permission only. Oh. What are you looking at, lad? I'd like to see what you have to offer. I'd like to see what you have to offer. Are you a blacksmith? Smart, lad. <laughs> I'm impressed. Certainly I'm a blacksmith. In fact, the best you'll meet between Stuart and Satara. For years in the service of the Barony of Silverlake and his lordship. His lordship has some problems, or so I've heard. By my anvil, lad, you got that right. The orc snatched and abducted him. Bloody disgrace. But weren't the orcs supposed to be friendly? We used to think so. For years, the slackers hung around their caves, quiet as mice. Until Airhag came. Airhag and his cronies. Where can I find Gilthor? The Castellan? In the Citadel. Just go up the stairs. What do you know about Airhag? Airhag is an orc warrior from Myrtana. He turned up with his gang and wanted to whip the lazy tribe into shape. But our lord wouldn't have any of that, so he bunged Airhag into the Gorge of the Penitents. The Gorge of the Penitents is some kind of a prison, isn't it? That is correct, lad. That's where troublemakers end up. The Silver Lake Archives, they're in the castle, right? No, outside, in Silver Lake. You can swim, can't you? Listen. Just joking, lad. Sure, the archives are here. Ask the Castellan. What happened to Erhag? After a couple of months, Lord Gowan put mercy before justice and had Erhag released. It was a stupid thing to do, as we now know. Erhag should never have left his cage again. What did Erhag do? Everything was quiet for a long time. Then our lord was dragged into the battle. As soon as he had left the castle, Erhag turned up at the gates, with his whole gang in tow. What was it the orcs wanted here? To capture the castle, lad, and what else? By my anvil, we showed them how people from the Silver Lake can fight. <laughs> Bunch of lousy orcs couldn't dream of capturing our castle. And how did they capture Gawain, then? Our lord was on his way back from the battlefield. A few men were with him, and all of them were tired and weak. We couldn't do anything. Right before our eyes, Lord Gowan was surrounded and overpowered. Why does nobody do anything to save the Lord? Lad, look around. What do you see? Weaklings, wounded, and women. Who'd march out and attack the orcs? Me? 
I make weapons, but I don't wield them. 